and I'm Amu, Citizen TV. All right, let's talk about something else here apart from that. And it's about masks. Really, we come to the KCC exams shortly. But for now, worshippers are supposed to wear masks in charge. That's according to the Interfaith Council of Kenya, who is now urging Kenyans not to drop their guard in the fight against COVID-19. The council's chair, Archbishop Anthony Muheria, cautioned that places of worship will be expected to continue observing COVID-19 protocols as the pandemic remains a real threat. This after the Ministry of Health announced a relaxation of the COVID-19 containment measures citing lower positivity rates in recent months. Despite a move by the Ministry of Health to relax COVID-19 safety protocols, worshippers will be required to wear face masks during services. The Interfaith Council of Kenya, during a media briefing Monday, while welcoming the government's move to lift COVID-19 measures, allowing the resumption of full in-person worship for vaccinated persons, cautioned that places of worship will be expected to observe hand washing, temperature screening and sanitization of shared items. We still warn that the COVID-19 pandemic is not yet over. The danger still hangs even as it seems to wane in its infectious spread we must not lower our guard the religious leaders rallied their members to get vaccinated but clarified that worshippers will not be required to show proof of vaccination we are encouraged by the uptake of vaccination and encourage as many kenyans as possible to receive the job as this will strengthen our resistance for any eventual wave and keep us operating normally. Archbishop Moharia also expressed concern about the country's political campaigns, urging politicians to take precautions to prevent infections. We continue to be concerned about the political gatherings that have totally ignored any measures of protection and the manner of crisscrossing of our nation. This still remains the greatest danger and risk in case of any new outbreak. Moheria asked Kenyans to reach out to families affected socioeconomically by the pandemic. We urge all Kenyans to be attentive and to come to the aid of many families affected seriously by the COVID-19 pandemic. We single out especially the COVID orphans and widows. We all, together with the government, should seek ways of mitigating their strife through some means of support. Kenya's positivity rate currently stands at 0.2%. Lillian Muli, Citizen TV.